All right, made it to Carbondale, Illinois. Dropped the wife off at work. First on the agenda, gonna hit this Goodwill, find tomorrow's clothes, so I don't have to worry about that. And maybe I'll find the next day too. I don't know, we'll see. It's a pretty decent college town. I don't know if you can see that because of the glare. University Mall. Um, so maybe they'll also have some good stuff. Maybe I'll find some band shirts or something. I won't get stuck with a, like a My Little Pony shirt or something like that. So uh, we'll go ahead in here, see if we can find anything worth anything also to resell. And let's go. All right, we got the uh, haul from this Goodwill in Carbondale, Illinois. And I'm not really in a thrifting mood. I'm just getting stuff that I like or enjoy to make my money back on this trip. I'm not like hunting stuff, looking stuff up or really anything difficult. Just not in the mood, at least not today. Um, so I'm not leaving a Prince CD behind for a dollar. I thought Trickster was a dollar. I didn't pay attention because their CDs are normally just a dollar a piece. Uh, so those I'm not going to make no money on, but I was going to just put them in the play. Actually, I don't even know. Ah, I don't think I got a CD player in here. This one also comes with a Tesla CD. Bonus! So those are nothing. Uh, this is probably only like a $5 to $8 item. I uh, got that just to more to listen to too, but don't have a CD player. Uh, it's Clash, 10 bucks. 10 to 15, let's call it 10. About 10 bucks on this CD. But 25 on this box set. And we got about 25 on this box set. So there, Let's say 80 bucks uh, made. I spent 25. 25, 24. So I'm gonna make about 80 back on all that. But my outfits. So I got kind of lucky and then I got a couple of bonus extras here. Um, well, the pants are just nothing huge. Just simple stuff. This is a backup pair I got because this is my size as I sit right now. Uh, so this is some green cargo shorts. This one's a little bigger, but I do have a belt with me. I brought a belt just in case. Uh, made in Egypt. Uh, some slug room, some red shorts there. I picked up an extra shirt just in case I needed one. And we got an Atari represent. So I could be clashy if I want to with all green. Or I can get Miss Amber Moon from WWE NXT if I can get this shirt laid out with one hand. Amber Moon. I didn't do the sniff test yet. It looks pretty clean. Yeah, it's been washed, so we're good there. Even though it's got a little couple of things on it, but oh well. Can't be picky, but at least I won't be clashing <laughs> too bad on day one or day two technically. So there we are. That's the first trip. Let's see where else the day can get us into. It is Sunday, so a lot of things are closed in these small towns. But I think I'm going to head to DuCoin now and uh, get some video of DuCoin and get some lunch.
is I was waiting for the Coca-Cola building. Love that building. So now we're coming up on Main Street. Still got the old theater there. It's pretty cool. thing I remember most about this main street is before Walmart came in it was so busy and they would just dress it up for Halloween I mean uh, for Christmas still looks pretty desolate the old bank building Cafe, a cafe is at least still there. So that's where we're, I'm doing lunch. I used to always get my hair cut there. Got the cool train tracks that run through center of town. streets to turn on. It's been so long. I guess I think I can turn on any of these. Probably should have turned back there, I think. Let's turn here. I don't remember that ever being there. Still got the same gravelly roads. the street name yes here it is so am I past it or kind of looks like it so yeah there we go so we had family who lived there and then this house here is where my aunt lived 226 Lindo I had who lived there. I wonder whatever happened to them. I wonder if they're still around here. Huh, that big house is gone. There was like a big white house that was eventually built. I didn't see it. I remember it being built and we're like, man, that's a big house for this street, this area. But, uh, let's go check lunch and then uh, maybe we'll do a little bit more exploring. So here it is, Main Street. It used to be called Inling's Cafe. Sorry for the wind. Let's go around here and see if uh, it's still painted on the building or not. No, don't see it no more. I think an old sign right there. I don't see it. It 
So I think back here is where, yeah, um, my dad would come and go fishing. Road ends in water. Okay, maybe this is way. I remember. Yeah, okay. Yeah, because I remember always seeing these like lily pads and stuff and always thinking how cool that looked. So cool. It's called City Lake. And we used to come, I didn't care for fishing, but I'd come out here with them. I'll show you why I love coming here. See the behind this? There used to be a walkway out to that and I would stand on it and fish off of it. But the cool thing is, ah, too bad the water's not up. When the water's up, we used to be able to drive through this. Almost there. And then it rolls down there. I'll show you what that looks like. They got it blocked off now? Or maybe you have to go that way. There used to be nice little trails you can walk down here because when the water of the lake was up and we'd run down there, there were streams and stuff down there. I just don't know if I feel like getting all itchy. So we'll go the waterfall way. So the one time I did fish, like I said, it was on a little pier that went out to that thing. And for me, fishing is boring as hell. So I'm sitting there, I got my pole in the water and I'm just daydreaming. True story when I tell you this, it's so funny. So I pictured fish lining up at the bank over here and I go one two three go first one to my hook wins and I'm like I'm like doing a play-by-play -play, like there's fish racing to my hook and swear to everything that as soon as I said like gotcha something got on my hook and I caught a fish it was like so weird I, that kind of weird shit happens to me all the time I can't explain it, but of course it only worked that one time. I tried it again and it didn't work. So here comes the motorcycle, but if you look over here, it's got this waterfall that goes down. We'll go down and walk on that. But they put this thing up so uh, cars can't drive down there. So this here is the little waterfall. I remember, I remember it being much bigger when I was a kid.